hey guys welcome back to my channel so this is the start of avery's birth vlog okay let me turn my phone off really quick so i today is january the 25th it's 9 59 at night and today i was having like some tightening in my stomach but it didn't feel like contractions it just felt like you know cramping um but then i went to the bathroom i was spotting i lost some of my mucus plug and so then i was having it's just like the tightening was concerning and then that and then some of the blood was like a little brown so i came to the hospital and they just finished checking me and I'm seven centimeters dilated. So last week when I went to my appointment on like Tuesday or something, I was three centimeters dilated, 50% e-phase. So she just came and checked me and I'm seven centimeters dilated. So I'm getting admitted. I am starting to have contractions and boy, whew, and I don't, and I forgot how long they last too. So yes, I'm gonna have a baby either. Probably not tonight, but but tomorrow on the 26th or the 27th, which is his due date. <sighs> and so, yes, and it's so crazy because my due date is soon. And now we're having a baby. I'm 40 weeks pregnant today, so I'm so excited. And I can't wait to vlog this whole experience. Okay, so hooked up to the monitors and I just finished having a contraction it was probably like 50 seconds long like almost a minute and whew, they're not coming that consistently right now but they definitely started um so have my IV in and yeah I'm just can't believe my baby will probably be here early in the morning I'm so excited to meet him but y'all contraction pain <sighs> no joke literally no joke but I'm about to take some pictures really quick of my belly on the little monitor and yeah Okay, so right now it's 11.32. Uh, my water broke at 11.13. And now we're just waiting. I'm still seven centimeters dilated. And I'm laying on my side just so his heart rate can stay steady. And I also got the epidural. So far, contractions, they were not that bad like how it was with a lid so i got the epidural so i didn't have to go through that much pain which is great so, are we supposed to answer that so As he comes down, well, it's 11.33. He'll probably be born on the 26th. So, I'm about to eat some ice, watch some stuff, and then that's it. So, right now, it's 12.16 a.m., so... Um, I did get the epidural. I'm all the way numb. Like my legs and stuff. And oh, I'm feeling some pressure. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Uh, oh 
hold on what oh my god oh my god oh my god my butt I'm really starting to feel like I could poop and they said when it feels like that like I might be close to like you know ready to poop This might be like a little bit much to say, but it feels like I got like the biggest like poop ready to come out. <laughs> okay, so y'all switch my bonnet, but I am okay. I was seven centimeters dilated, and I think I forgot how much he faced, but basically. I hope he comes, y'all, within the next couple of hours because I am so ready to get all this pressure over with. But I have this thing, so I'm laying sideways like this because um, his heart rate was dropping every time I have a contraction. So they're trying to just put me in different positions. So they did give me this thing. I forgot what it was called, but it's like putting fluid back up there and um, I just went ahead and did it because you know anything to make sure my baby is you know his heart rate's dropping that's important to me to make sure he's good oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> um so yeah baby will be here definitely sometime today on the 26th and i'm so ready i'm so ready y'all to meet him he is gonna get circumcised and i think we're gonna have to be here for two days two days but for right now i'm about to just rest and I will come back. I don't know when, but I know I'm not going to be able to record the parts of me um, actually pushing. But yeah, it's just pressure right now. Like, it's not pain from, like, you know, cramping from the epidural, it's just pressure down below. Didn't do oh, for me. <laughs> do you see? Is it recording? Yes. Why oh, is he so quiet? He's good. He's just resting. He had a big old cry earlier. He had a double nipple tear. Oh, yeah. So I was like, that makes sense. That makes sense. Right. So, check that. so <laughs> I'm going to um, just clamp it for you. you where to cut when to cut okay call him baby you know he's good he's just he's very loud he has a long some lungs over here he sure does you okay that's a thick cord Clamp. 
can I get a cord? I'm going to cut, cut the cord. I'm going to cut the clamp. Oh, okay. I'm going to cut it off. And another, and another one. Yeah, another one. And I need to cut this one off. You guys have one of those in here? Um, we, I don't even know if we carry that nursery normally does, but we, uh, He's got it's such a, a thick corn. Like a purple corn pants. Like mm. a what? Hey, nursery just a little longer on the bottom. Okay. Yeah, if we got any um, surgical scissors? No, they're not. We have big fat surgical scissors in there? So cute. It's just chilling. Mm -hmm. We're just trying to cut the clamp off that we got on there, make it a little bit longer. Oh, so no, we're not in a big hurry. Well, Yes and no. Yeah, I, I'd like it now so that we can go ahead and, and finish what we're doing. Gotcha. And I don't want to get his little skin right there. You sure. see, it's under it, but I don't want to irritate. It's gonna gotcha. get, you know, irritated. Hi, 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 buddy. Look at how handsome you are. Huh? Do another picture. Both knees. I can't get it off. You can try. Maybe your hands are stronger than mine. Go for it. I have it in just like two seconds. It's not open. This way for a second. I'm sorry. Yeah. Learn that trick. Kind of. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There is a little tiny thing right here. You just go underneath of it and then nice. lift it up oh, if I can get under there. He has a really pretty juicy cord. So he does. It's very fat. If you think you can get it with the scissors quicker, try it. Otherwise, you want to have to draw my hand or anything. There we go. Oh, let's get the penis out of the way. <laughs> yeah, I definitely want the boy parts. Intact. <laughs> Those things are just so thick. Yeah. What's the. Oh, she got one. You want to try the straight ones? Oh, Sesame. Let's do it. It's good they make these things to, you know, stay on. on. There you good go. Good job. All right. Hi there. Thank you so much. Yes, ma'am. The paper too, clip too, works, though. <laughs> He's strong. Paper strong. Yeah. Want to work out with me? No. No. She said no. No. She said no. You ain't strong enough to work out with me. We ain't working out. Y'all be good to get me walking down these hallways. Gosh, it's such a thick cord. All right. Are you ready to cut? Yeah. Let me grab that other little clamp. Yeah. This is perfect. All right. So it won't hurt the baby. It yeah. won't hurt you. Um, it's going to be squishy. Did you cut your first one? You got it on video? So you're going to go... You're going to go in between these two. So down in there. Yep, there you go. Are you getting it on video? Yes, it's there. Is it going to do it in one? No, you probably chew it. I'm just taping this down to you while you're doing I don't want to lose it. You're doing great. Good job. Good job. Juicy core. He doesn't want to irritate his little. He got some. And look at this. Look at the It's so long. You did so good. You grew a great baby strong cord. I'm going to over here. And try to clean out. Thank you guys for helping me do that. Yes. You small. You got his little eye cream. See, Leah going to be so shocked. She ain't got no belly to roll in there. <laughs> Okay, we'll come back with his weight and measurements. 
Okay, here. Is it recording? Make sure you get it. Okay, okay, look. I'm gonna come on this side if you want. Come on. Cry, baby. <laughs> he has some big hands like Leia. Mm-hmm. Lay, lay, this time. Out of it. <laughs> no, 
sorry, buddy. Alright, we're gonna say 12.25. 12.25. Well, you got a little big head, 12.25. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, <laughs> the little squeals. <coughs> so crazy, I know it. <coughs> Warming him up because he's cold. Okay, let me get you to come around so you can get this on there. Okay. It's like seven pounds something to me. Seven pounds and then two point one ounces. Mm -hmm. I knew he wasn't gonna be that big. That's smaller than the lay, I think. And then he's twenty one inches long, which I knew he was gonna be twenty one inches long. Cause I knew he was gonna be taller than Dre. I'm so ready. I can't put on no more lip gloss. I'm gonna just put on this one. He's about to get swaddled and stuff. Yeah. <coughs> After this, I'm going to do the first 24 hours. So I'm a little nervous, but we're gonna get that done. But y'all, the birth, the pushing part was way different from my layer. Like I felt it. Well, I didn't feel it, but with him, I felt it, and I wanted to give up, but I had to keep pushing through because his heart rate was dropping, and when he came out, the cord was wrapped around his neck, so. Oh, the little aluminum hat? Oh, yeah. Okay. It's so cute. aluminum hat well you guys um we're about to go to the other room and then it's 2 or 8 in the morning so once we get to the other room i'll close out the labor and delivery and start the first 24 hours with a new one i'm so excited <laughs> He going to sleep? 
Oh God, no. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> mm. Avery is hungry. So he's about to eat. I did give him the booby, but now he getting the papa. They got the hats and stuff over there. The baby eat the milk. You know the nipples too big. No. I thought they'd be smaller than that. Be careful. Oh no. Now you gotta get used to it. Oh. When you get home, we got some Avent bottles. We got some Avent bottles when the baby get home. Did you get the other hat? No, I get it, Annie. Either way, like I was supposed to say, I gotta get this thing ready, so you got time to get it. Okay. Mm -hmm. You hungry or you tired? If he bleeds, I can keep this on. If he does bleed, but if he doesn't, I'm gonna leave it right here, Mama. Let me get his 
blankets ready. Do y'all know how to swallow? Yeah. And if you want to videotape this moment, I'm going to show y'all how to do it. So y'all find a corner from the blanket. You want baby's head and shoulders to be above that triangle. Okay. All right, Kayla, now I'm going to take them from you really quick. Okay. And I'll hand them back to you. Hey, buddy. Oh, no. I don't want to go anywhere. Okay, I got you, buddy. I got you. <laughs> arm down. He's not going to like it. Do one side first. I'm trying to keep that arm down. And then I like to roll him over this way towards me and get as much of this underneath his back and butt. As much as you can. Then you roll him back over. Arm down again. And then you do the bottom part. Right corner. You're going to go behind this shoulder. Tuck as much of that as you can into. This side. Again, if you can roll them over some. The trick is to get as much of those corners tucked in. Alright, buddy, let's go to Kayla. There you go. He's beautiful, y'all. Congratulations. Thank you. Do y'all have any questions for me before I go? If y'all can think of anything, just let us know. Okay, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I did want to ask, will he get one of those, like, um, little shirts? Like, the made, little, like, like, from the, here? The, the, no, like, the little white shirt they put them on before their bath. Mm-hmm. They're actually the ones that we have here in the crib. Yeah, and then a bird cloth too. Uh huh. So, got some extra t shirts in there. Yeah, that's what I was Lay it here for whenever y'all. When can I put it on him? As soon as you'd like, at any any point. Okay. Mm -hmm. then, the best to do it when he gets it good and warm. Uh huh, and then a bird cloth right here for you. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. The crib moves around, guys, so you can. Release the brake, move it closer to you, get the brake back on. Y'all have supplies in here. If y'all run out of any diapers or wipes, just let us know and we'll get y'all more. Okay, thank you. Thank y'all. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. So Avery is asleep and right now it is 4.30 and I just peed. She wheeled me into the bathroom and then she let me walk. So I'm cleared to walk now. I knew I would be good though. And I changed my gown. This is how my belly looks after. Then I got on my diaper, so let me show y'all. For the people who, you know, might be first time moms. So they give me these little mesh underwear things, then these giant pads, and then they give me these little ice things. So um, I'm also going to show y'all something else really quick, or I'll just show y'all that tomorrow in the next video, which is the first 24 hours with a newborn. Oh, also, some little blood on here. Sorry, y'all. But this is the little 
peri bottle that they give at my hospital for me so yes that's everything i need to use the bathroom so avery is asleep right now i did feed him he got his first shots as y'all seen so now i'm about to try to sleep um and then you know this was pretty much the end of my laboring delivery vlog so i hope you guys enjoyed it the next video will be my first 24 hours so i'm literally after i go to sleep next time you wake up i'm gonna start back recording and then i will do our going home and then him meeting a layer for the first time so i hope you guys enjoyed this labor and delivery vlog it was definitely a different experience from Alea. i think i said this earlier but the pushing was who but i had to stay strong because he um his heart rate kept dropping so um so yeah here's our hospital room they brought me some food it was right there i'm about to put him beside the bed but yeah so i'm gonna close this so we can rest a little bit but leave it crack and then here we are so thank you guys so much don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next video. Bye, guys. So, right now, baby is head down. And oh, my gosh. Right position. I kind of thought he was because I went to Ikea this weekend. I said, um, he must be head down because <laughs> the pain... That's so crazy. Yeah, I can feel him moving. Holy cow! He's definitely <laughs> busy. What are you doing? I want to get your legs. Okay, there's the stomach. Measuring around the baby's belly like a belt. Would you be able to kind of like maybe estimate how much he weighs right yeah. now? Yeah, I'm going to take the um, measurements and okay. then I'll be able to tell you. Let's see if he's flattered. Okay, he's that leg bone again, not staying still. Does the baby have a name yet? Yeah, it's gonna be Avery.
hiding with our hand over our face. Come on. <laughs> He's like, this is the only view of my face that you're going to get today. <laughs> Put the baby together like a puzzle on these little pieces. 